Exactly, and that's the problem that we've been hearing since the hurricane swept through the area. And for people who call the beach home, they just feel like they're being ignored when they're trying to rebuild. And that's some pretty big projects, as you can see behind me. This is what the reality of what they're facing and what they're trying to fix. And so when I spoke with beach leaders today, they tell me they're aware of these concerns and they're working as hard as they can to be able to fix them. So as Nadine just told you, starting tonight, the permitting department hours have been extended. They're now running from 7.30 in the morning to 6.30 at night during the week, and then 7.30 to 5.30 on Saturdays. Now, since the second week of October, Jenny Dexter, she's actually the spokesperson for Fort Myers Beach. She tells me almost 4,500 permit applications have either been completed or are currently being processed at this time since that second week of October. Now, Dexter says the extended hours should help them cut their numbers down, but says one of the other problems is they don't have enough employees to handle the current volume of permits. Our permitting department was pretty small before Hurricane Ian and we have just recently been able to beef it up some with some temporary uh, permitting techs. Dexter said they added eight additional techs this week, but they still need more. Now, Fox 4 is working to learn just how many total outstanding permits are left to be completed. Dexter says the state has provided them with several temporary workers, but says the amount of permits they are seeing is around three times more than what they were dealing with before even. Ian, but... After speaking with people who call Fort Myers Beach home, the other issue, Nadine, is that they're saying it's communication. Now, coming up on Fox 4 News at 6 o'clock, I'm taking some more of their concerns to beach leaders, and I'll have their answer for you when I check in at the top of the hour. But for now, live in Fort Myers Beach, Colton Chavez, Fox 4.